for joining us here in this Friday morning. I'm Cooper. And I'm Scott. This week there's going to be an interview with Miss Penning. The Rams update with Ben and me. And a PSA on personal space. But first the question of the week. What's your favorite tea garden? What is your favorite tea garden drink? Uh, I like mango strawberry. What's your favorite tea garden drink? I like the pineapple, uh, pineapple strawberry mix over there. What's your favorite drink at Tea Garden? Um, strawberry cooler. Thanks for the answers, Ramsey. And now for the Rams update with Ben and me. I'm on the Rams update. And I'm Ben. <laughs> <laughs> Ramsey baseball team is 1-2, and two, lost to Highland and Capitol Hill, but won against Parkway. Batman's team record is 2-1, and one, lost to Washington, won against uh, Farnsworth and Humboldt. The boys track team won the first meet and got second on the second, and the girls track team got second on both meets. Now let's check out the students of the month. Hello Ramsey students, staff, and community. It's that time of the month for the student of the month. And our sixth grade student of the month is Kevin Zarobi. Congratulations. Madame Thibault said you're caring, willing to work with everyone. You have great balance. You can transition from having fun to being serious. And Ms. Schnett said you're a strong, reflective communicator. You, you exemplify, exemplify MYP qualities and you help build a strong class and community and finally you consistently work with fellow classmates to support them and encourage them. So congratulations, we're real proud of you. Thank you. All right. And our seventh grade student of the month is Adriana Yang. Yeah. Congratulations. Yeah. And Ms. Messer said Adriana exhibits leadership in your class by modeling how to act and behave. She is an inquirer who is curious about learning in the uh, world around her. She always asks questions, is quick to participate, help other students stay on task, and you are a student who cares about learning. Adriana is caring and open-minded, and you're a joy to have in class. Congratulations. Thank you. You're welcome. Student of the month for, of March for the eighth grade is Cindy Zhang. Thank you. Congratulations. And you were nominated by three different teachers. Um, one teacher said, you always go above and beyond without fanfare. Very helpful and mature. Um, Ms. Uh, Snodgrass and Mr. Rushke said, uh, you are a very reliable student, pleasant to have in class. And Mr. Rushke added, you never lose focus on what uh, he's teaching. You're kind, thoughtful, focused, and disciplined. Congratulations. Thank you. Congratulations to the students of the month. Yeah. Now let's see what's going on in some of the classrooms around the school. I did the Rams update. And I'm Ben. Okay. Thanks for being awesome, Ramsey. Now an interview with Miss Penning. Um, we are here interviewing Miss Penning. What is your name and what do you do here at Ramsey? My name is Miss Penning. <laughs> and I teach seventh grade life science, also known as biology, which is the study of living things. Why did you choose to teach life science? Uh, I chose to teach life science because I was inspired by my ninth and 10th grade biology teachers. My ninth grade biology teacher actually got a frog out of the pond, dissected it while it was living, and we actually saw its heart pumping and its lungs going you know, in and out, up and down, and it was the coolest thing I'd ever seen, and I just thought, 
this is it. This is what is your favorite ice cream? My favorite ice cream is cake batter by um, Cold Stone Cold Stone Memory. Nothing in it, just plain. What was your favorite subject when you were our age? You mean in middle school slash junior high? Yeah. You're seriously asking me that question. Yeah. Well, what do you think it was? English? <laughs> yeah, it was English. It was life science. Is there anything else you want to add or tell us? Yeah, it's my birthday Saturday and I'm going to be 39 years older. 39? Who, who's this? Miss Penning? This is Aldina, uh, a bearded dragon. It's actually my daughter's. She got it for her birthday five years ago, but doesn't want to clean the cage. So now it's at school. Really? Mm -hmm. We thought she was a he until she started laying eggs a couple summers ago. Really? Thanks for that interview, Miss Benning. Now for a PSA on personal space. Yoshi. Mm -hmm. So I've heard a lot about people invading others' personal bubble. I know. I know you feel like I hate it when people get up my grill and people like that. Yeah. So this one kid came up behind me and he started touching my hair and he started braiding my hair, and it was really uncomfortable. So what do you think I should do if he does it again? I'll say this to him: Get out of my bubble. But what do you say you would do? Um, maybe I'll just right. say. Please respect my personal bubble. Thank you, Yoshi and Lila, for that great PSA. I would just like to add on a couple things. Um, respecting people's personal space goes for everyone at Ramsey. That's students respecting other students, students respecting our staff members and teachers, and teachers respecting uh, our students' personal space. This would involve anytime you are in the school, in the hallways, the classrooms, the lunchrooms, on the buses, outside on the uh, grounds of Ramsey, okay? People's personal space is their person, their body, their hair, whether they have it or not, uh, their lockers, their backpacks, uh, their lunch, anything that belongs to them. If it belongs to them and not you, please respect it. Don't uh, invade their personal space, okay? Thank you all for respecting the personal space of our staff and students at Ramsey. And if anyone does, Go into your personal space. If you don't feel comfortable, just say, please respect my personal space. Or as Yoshi said, get out of my bubble. Have a great day, Ramsey. Yeah, get out of my Thanks bubble. Thanks for joining us, Ramsey. I'm Scott. And I'm Cooper. From all of us here at the Ramsey Show, stay classy, Ramsey. Thanks for joining us here on this Friday morning. I'm Cooper. What? What was that? Oh, <laughs> oh. <laughs> okay, we're done. Thank you, Miss Penning. Thanks for the interview, Miss. Nope, I just thought okay, that would okay. sound better. Yeah, that kind of sounds quick. Here, so I can see when the red light turns on. But you're just gonna have to deal with this tomorrow. You're just okay, gonna just, have to wait. Just leave it on so I can go on. Now let's check out the student of the month, months, month, whatever that is. Students of the month. Okay, we need to redo that. Yeah, this one girl saw. Got, 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 got. Thanks again for. Hang on. I was about to say the.